to one of my videos, I will show you how to configure DNS. You do it, you click on the new zone, and then you click next. This is going to be a primary zone because it's going to be part of the DNS servers, which we're going to be used throughout the actual servers. So I need to keep this in the prime one. I need to keep this also on the DNS servers and on the domain controllers. So we need to keep that the same. The forward lookup name in that zone is OK2. And what you need to do is um, call it a name. Go next. Allow for dynamic updates. This is recommended by the Microsoft um, website. And then you click next and then finish. Right. Just going to open the um, NS name record. And what this does is it, this actually a say zone transfer, so you can actually connect it to any server. And that's the one what I'm going to have on for these NS records. Okay, so then if I go to the ACLA, this is staff of authority, and these are like um, time intervals. This is good for today. This is actually the same tab as the actual one I just showed you. Okay. I'm going to show you how to create a reverse lookup zone. So what I need to do is create a new zone. I need to keep it the same on the primary zone. IP feed bomb. It's a 10. Ten. And we just go next. And we go next, next, next. And it should be able to finish.